Good afternoon. I hope you enjoyed the student made video you just watched from last year's service learning class. My name is Oscar Medina. I'm a social studies teacher and lead instructor for service learning here at Toltecali High School in South Tucson, Arizona. I want to thank the organizers of the Arizona Summit on volunteerism and service learning. I especially want to thank my colleagues Nicole Snook and Louis Perales as well as former student Anaisa Carrillo for letting me do this pre-recorded video presentation in my absence. My role as a teacher transitioning into Toltecali High School started in August of 2011. I was hired to teach social studies at our school knowing that we were under school improvement using a turnaround model, which resulted in the eliminating of some good teachers prior to my arrival. State laws like HR 2281 also had an impact at our school because it destroyed our ethnic studies and Mexican American studies program. With these systemic changes, we saw some teachers' jobs disappearing overnight. Those were the conditions that laid the work for my transition into a high school that had a strong service learning component to it. At Toltecali High School, I inherited an infrastructure that was set up by teachers prior to my arrival that paved the work that students and I were going to engage in. Last year, the partnerships were crucial to our service learning program because they brought resources and created collaborations that made our projects possible. Nonetheless, the students were so open to service learning because they connected directly to the work they were doing. In our group last year, we had artists that wanted to do something positive in the community with their talent we had students who had experience living in farms in Mexico and understood the importance of farming organically. We had students that were accepting and interested because they knew that years prior, students were committed to transforming their school and their community all while skilling up for their future. Today at Toltecali High School, we're using APART service learning tools in our community-based education senior class. We continue to focus on food systems and local food production. We're continuing the same partnerships we had from last year and focusing on researching sustainable systems in the community with an emphasis on food justice. Students are developing academic social science research skills they're learning about, their, about urban agriculture, permaculture, landscaping, composting, and food systems. Students are working closely with local farmers to make organic fruits and vegetables more accessible to members in their community. Also, we're training youth in environmental literacy and practice through the Roots of Success curriculum. This is a job readiness program intended to help our students transition into the green economy and green jobs. To conclude, I want to stress that partnerships are vital to the service learning projects. Nonetheless, students, their resources, and the knowledge they bring into the classroom are also highly valuable to the development of the service learning project because it becomes a meaningful project that directly impacts their lives and their communities.